on a typical night, what are three things that you'll work on with elite baseball and, and try to increase player development? Um, in the cages, we like to create a uh, high energy atmosphere. Um, we like to create a competitive atmosphere. Um, we'll have upwards to 15 kids in the cages um, per session, which run about an hour and a half. Um, we have 10 bullet points that we usually hit on. Now, I mean, that's a little information overload for a lot of the kids, so we'll focus on two or three. Um, some, of the, some of the main things that we really, really stress are staying in your base, staying on your lower half, um, relaxation, never be in a rush, and have repeatable swings. We need to make sure these kids have repeatable swings because a lot of evaluators are going to be looking for repeatable swings and repeatable actions. Um, those three things we, we mainly focus on. Obviously, we get into a little bit more detail uh, once they get more advanced, but you know they need to, they need to make sure that those three things are solidified and, and they're able to move forward with those. Matt, tell me a little bit about the difference between elite baseball instructors and maybe some of the other programs. Sure. Um, elite baseball brings in instructors um, with a minimum college uh, college degree. Uh, they played college baseball. Um, most of us have played professional baseball. Uh, we're high. We're high energy. We're high intensity. Um, we're, we're looking forward to developing these kids the proper way. Uh, we've been there. We, we know what it takes to get there. Um, we know our, our faults. We know our weaknesses, things that we didn't succeed with that we can kind of tell these kids, hey, this is what to expect. This is what to learn right now um, in, order to in order to make the team. Uh, talk a little bit about how having those facilities uh, can make a vast impression on these young high school players. Well, I mean, that's another differentiation where um, when we're talking to a parent or we're talking to a player and they want to start working out with elite baseball, obviously UC Irvine is a huge sell. Um, kids want to come into Division One facilities and hit. Um, it's not every day that you get the opportunity to walk on this field, let alone get in the cages and hit with professional instructors. Um, so having UC Irvine as a facility, um, having UCLA hopefully in the future um, as a facility um, it, it is, just a, is just a huge asset for us. It's a huge asset for players. It gets them surrounded in this environment so that when they do step foot on a campus, it's, it's not, it's not a, I, you know, eyes are all wide and you know, they, they know what to expect.